Rangers Alliance. Yo, what happened to ridding our streets of crime? Enlightenment is meant for all of our youngsters' minds. Yo, what happened to being there for your brother? No matter the color, you were there for each other. Yo, what happened to Arsalama Laker? In a bond, March 2nd, 2037 Solar flares hit a nuclear plant And it sent 11 waves crashing into cities Leaving nothing in its wake but destruction Politicians, money, and corruption That was Earth, a battlefield of energy The turf, where history was first written Kinda like this verse, I travel back to 2015 To spin it and it worked I was lethal then with the pen Today I'm much worse What's up? I'm DJ Tones, representing Cutthroat Entertainment. This is my Vinyl Fighters interview. This road of Jamming in the car all the time, riding around. Jamming the house, cleaning. I had an uncle that was a DJ. And cousins that introduced me to a lot of jams. So that's how Tom's came around the music. Nice. And the B-Boy scene, man. Can never let that go, because that's what got me into what I'm doing now. This right here, the reason why I keep this up there in my ticket because the last time I entered DMC was in Austin. Man, that was back in 2003 or 04, man. I don't remember. Probably 03. It's just all my mixes I come up with. Can't look at them all though because other niggas might want to stay, check my battery routines out. I mostly look for hip hop classics, but I like listening to drum breaks. Horns, trumpet, piano sounds, keys, battle breaks, any rock or sometimes picture vinyl. That's what I look for. This record right here, man. This record right here, I remember as a kid going to Spin Masters, which was on Northwest and Plano Road upstairs. I believe A1 worked there. I'm not sure, but I mean, I remember seeing him there. My uncle pointed out who he was, but this record right here, I just remember being there and wondering, man, what the fuck is this shit? It's got a crazy looking duck on there. And the next thing you know, I own three of them. It's just one of them. But yeah, man, that's why I like looking at this, man, reminiscing when I wasn't a DJ, trying to be one. That's one of my first setups. Sorry, ass makes it. All these records up here, man, they just, it's like from so East Coast to West Coast to South, because that's the representation of what I do, man. Like, my view of hip hop, because some people might not like Southern music, but I mean, it was around and it was kind of better in certain East Coast, but not the most. You can't knock the East Coast. That's where it came from. Well, my collection is pretty spread out. It's I've been a hip hop DJ, but at the same time I'm a mobile DJ, so I have everything from maybe like salsa to house to breaks to hip hop, you know, so on. So, but I really I mainly like hip hop and. The only thing I like personally out of my collection is the battle breaks. Because I deal with them every day, all day.
DJs to inspire the next man, really the next youngster in the crowd watching, curious to what I'm doing, why is he making that noise, how is he doing it, why does he want to do it, you know, that that's what I really want, so the legend and uh, not really a legend man, but the, the art of turntablism is carried on, that's what I like to see straight up. I, I like to work with um, a couple cats from Rebel, actually Rebel Planet, I like to work with them maybe here and there, you know, shout out to the homie Priest, that's their DJ, you know, I respect that, but I wouldn't mind featuring here and there. A new cat coming up named Skaduff, you might not heard of him, but you probably will. Um, Kilo, Joy the Bull, I mean, it's, it's, it's on and on, man.